Brown, they're coming. Good morning, everyone, and welcome back to Lady Fire's Kitchen. So what is up here in Lady Fire's Kitchen? Well, we have a new appetizer for you, and it's called Bacon Wrap. We only need four ingredients for this particular uh, recipe. Bread, we all have bread at home, right? Bacon, cream cheese, and pineapple preserve. That's all we need. We put it together in just a minute, so I'll be right back so we can get started. All right, everyone, let's get started. So we have all of our ingredients are right here. Easy access. So what I'm going to do first is I'm going to take the bread and I'm going to start putting some of the cream cheese on it. This is sort of like making a peanut butter jelly sandwich, but with a twist and it's better. So get your cream cheese, spread it on your bread, like so, very simple. Ensure that your cream cheese is at room temperature because if not, we're going to be breaking that bread. So make sure that it is room temperature so that it can go easy on the bread without breaking it like so. And then we're going to get the other um, slice of bread and we're going to put some pineapple preserve on it like so. Very simple. This is a very simple recipe to make and the end result is just amazing. Um, who would have thought, right? And one good trick, if you heard my uh, oven back there, I already started my oven at 350 degrees so that it's already preheated before I put this in because of course I have to cook the bacon. So here we are. Done. So we're going to just gonna put them together, just like peanut butter jelly, together. And now we're just gonna cut the crust. I don't think anybody likes the crust that much. So let's cut it off. So just remove that. Or four sides. And I think I, I'm, I'm going to cut them like to have three, three sides um, or in three, uh, I'm gonna do three, two cuts so I can get three pieces of bread. That's what I'm trying to say. So let me try to get this as, there's my one and there's my two. There we go. What we're gonna do now if we're gonna use the bacon. And I'm gonna use the whole slice of the bacon and I'm gonna wrap it around this bread, just like that. Just like that. And I'm just gonna start, I'm not gonna spray my, um, my pan with anything because the bacon alone is going to get uh, some of this fat out. So it's gonna be easy to remove from there. So we're just gonna put it just like this. Here, and we do it again. By the way, guys, I had this recipe uh, last year at my sister's in law's house. At this, I think the girls made it, and we got out of there. I wish I would have had more and I have missed it. And the other day I saw her at one of the, uh, two of the girls were playing volleyball. And I said, give me that recipe because I really need to eat that again. And I wanna make it uh, so that everybody knows um, how to make this. And um, so she gave it to me. So thank you, Suhayu, so very much. I appreciate it. I think it's her mom taught her. She taught me and I'm teaching you, <laughs> okay? So we're just gonna keep on going, keep on doing the same thing. We're gonna get a few of them done. So we'll be right back. Guys, we are ready to put this in the oven. I already got all my pineapple bacon wraps. Look at that. I, I cannot wait to have them uh, in my mouth, to be quite honest. <laughs> so let's put them in the oven. Come on, follow me. Here we go.
Okay, guys, I think they're ready, so let's get them. Ooh, look at this. I tried to, I'm gonna try to put them in here and I put a little bit of paper so it can absorb some of that extra fat. Don't they look delicious? Trust me guys, you are not going to regret making this recipe. It's one of the best things I have ever tasted. I wanted to thank the following my following beautiful nieces uh, that um, I don't know which one of the four made this recipe for us last time, but I'm just gonna thank them all anyway. I wanted to thank Bella, Gabby, Nessie, and Lily. Thank you guys, love you all. I hope you enjoyed this recipe. I believe this is a touchdown! And without further ado, every, every Saturday at 11 a.m., you will have me, and then right after, you will have Flat Cat Piper and his co-host talking about what else? Football. So without further ado, stick around. They're coming shortly.